Okay, see, it's over now. It's over! It's over! Lamar Wilson. How you doing? Good to see you, Lamar Wilson here. Back for another video, and this is a highly requested video called What's on my Xbox One X? This is a special edition because Seagate reached out and wanted to sponsor this video. And here's why. I, I have used Seagate external drives for the longest, but they came out with a special one. This is the Seagate game drive for Xbox Gears 5 Special Edition. Now what makes this special? Well, it has Xbox firmware in it. So it is seriously plug and play, no extra external power. It is ready to go as soon as you plug it into your Xbox in the front or the back. It also comes with DLC, which includes an ice block lantern weapon skin and supply drop stacked with random goods. Also includes a complimentary one month membership to Xbox Game Pass, which can be stacked on top of another membership. So you have like a eight month membership right now. You buy this, get that membership, it adds another month. Now you have nine months, pretty cool. And you might see here in the drive that it has the 3D Omen design on the game drive itself. And this particular drive is a two terabyte drive. So if you're interested in getting a lot of more storage, well, check out the link below. And thanks Seagate for supporting and sponsoring this video. So I have this in a uh, alphabetical order of what's installed. I have 272 games total. <laughs> Now, some of those do include uh, the Game Pass, but like a few. And I have, yeah, so 59 are installed on my storage. 213 are still ready to install. We'll look at both. Anthem, why, <laughs> what a game to start with. Listen, I liked the story mode. I played through it. When I was done, I was like, what's next? And will your servers ever work? Apex Legends, I have not, well, I have played it. I have not gotten heavy into it because my friends are really far ahead of, of, of me and like don't have patience to like try to help a noob. So um, I, I do have another friend because I only play with friends, but I, I have another friend who's gonna uh, work with me on, on there. Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I don't, I don't. God, how many hours have I put in that game? Well over two hundred, maybe three hundred hours. It is, and and they just keep coming. Well, I, actually, I think they finished the DLC, but it was just like a year's worth of just amazing content it is the most beautiful game i have played i love greek mythology so i was so absorbed in all the locations and it's just an amazing game i like it. that was my between that and you know spider-man ps4 those are my two top games at, at, at the time and i just, just absolutely love it borderlands 3 I, let me show you who i'm playing with just to give you some perspective because some of you are like that's all it's the only place you are i filmed this about a week before it's going to come out so a week ago <laughs> from, from right now i was at level 20 and i'm using zane zane is great uh zane is fantastic i i i love zane i don't want to use i mean i love all the other characters i've seen in videos look great but zane is, is me and, and so I don't want to give any spoilers. I don't want, I was going to jump in and, and play a little bit, but I just realized where I am, especially right now, it's going to give away like parts of the game. I, I don't think I should. Another one of my favorite games of all time, Bur uh, Burnout Paradise Remaster. I played it first in the 360. I love the remaster. It looks gorgeous. I, I wish they would keep making Burnout games. I have not played Control yet because I was playing Borderlands 2 at a pre-sequel when I came out. And by the time of, I was done, then Borderlands 3 came out and Gears 5 and I, ah! I have not played Devil May Cry yet. I know, I know guys, I know. Fortnite, I play mostly with my cousin because they, they like to play. And so, yeah, I still keep it. Forza Horizon 4, one of my favorite driving games right now. Like, it's just so beautiful. And they have a Lego uh, section, which is a DLC. Like, like you can get Forza Horizon 4 on the Game Pass, but the Lego part is a DLC you have to pay for. Oh, look at this Lego city. Oh man, look at my car. It is so, okay, let's take, just look at this track. This is all Lego. My car, okay. <laughs> it's been a minute. Uh, oh man, okay. So yeah, I'm just looking behind me there. Okay, I probably should look in front of me, but look, look, everything turns to Legos when you hit it. So I'll be hitting things on purpose for you all. <laughs> See, I'm gonna run into these houses just to show you. Look at the Lego people. Oh, I just, I just hit the house. Why are you inside the house though, like that? Okay, your head is, is scaring me. Okay, now, is that a window? Wait, okay, I was gonna say, how are you in the house? Anyway, that's the Lego DLC. Again, one of the biggest games uh, out right now, Gears 5. I'm having a blast with it. I, obviously, the, the drive I'm, I'm on, again, Seagate sponsored thing is Gears 5. I absolutely love Gears 5. Uh, I did put it down a little bit for Borderlands, 
three because I had a week to play Gears and then Borderlands came. It was so hard. What's all the highlights here? Injustice 2 always because DC and Wonder Woman and... Uh, okay, anyway. This is interesting because first of all, I don't have any friends. Second of all, I have uh, Jack's, the Jackbox Party Pack 1, 2, 3, and then 5. Where is 4? Jump Force, just to let you know, it, I know it wasn't really a popular game. A lot of people didn't buy it, but it's on, as of the recording of this, it's on Xbox Game Pass. So jump in. Life is Strange 2 is interesting. I know some of y'all are not going to like hearing this, but I wasn't feeling it. And and it was not it's not the game. It's me. The problem is I was playing a high action high action games right before it and then when I finally just said, "Okay, I'm going to jump into it." It was boring. And that it is not the game. It's I was hyped up for playing all these fast action games. So I just got to get into a chill mode and then I'll jump right back into it and it'll be fine cuz I love Life is Strange 1. The first one, and before the storm, I played those. NBA Playgrounds 2, I, uh, I love. Pepin! Okay, okay, what happened was, give me that. Give me that ball. Give, give. Okay, see, it's over now. It's over! It's over! <laughs> I am still gonna win this. Okay, watch this, guys. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Watch this. Oh! <laughs> Jordan! Jordan! Take that. Oh, that's in. That's not in. That's okay. I won. I won. I won. It don't matter. I won. I'm calling a comeback. I've been here for years. Cracking the tears. I, that's not the word. I, look at, look at the boy. Step it, step it, MVP. Okay, I enjoyed that too much. I wasted so much time. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, I haven't been 2K20. As of the recording of this, I have not started it yet, but I plan to this weekend. So by the time you watch this, I will have played some of it. I just, I'm just behind. Playing versus zombies. I'm playing with a friend right now. Uh, so it's, I don't, I don't guess you can call it early access. If you're doing an early access thing, I guess it's not gonna bug until October when it officially launches. But I'm having so much fun with this, this game. It is like delightfully great. It's, it's Call of Duty with plants and zombies i mean it's great I, I i love the game but uh rock band four I, anybody comes over i don't have friends so like anybody who comes over i don't care if they like maintain they're here to like fix my sink or something they're like do you have 10 minutes to play rock band with i just i need somebody to sing the division another looter shooter game i, I really enjoy it i have not played it since they changed some some stuff in the last couple of months. Uno, which is really fun. Don't don't sleep on Uno. Okay, it's it's a fun game. And the Will of Fortune, I've played that with Dashy on his channel. Real quick, and I do mean quick, here are some of the things that are ready to install. I'm not gonna read them. Uh we'll just kind of scroll down. A lot of these are 360 games. Some of these are Xbox uh for go games for gold. And some are just games I just have had. So yeah, I have a quite a all oh, the Batman games. I hope they come out with a new with a new one. I really do. Um, Brothers, okay, I said I wasn't gonna do this. Brothers was so good, so good. It was, it is, it's an indie game, but it's like really, really good. Uh, let's see, City Skylines, what are you doing over here? I guess I didn't install you, okay. I, 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 I kinda wanna install you. I want you to be installed, at least on this Xbox. Okay, so we'll, we'll yeah, you 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 get over there and you, in, and you get installed. Uh, I don't know how long this is gonna take. So here's some more games. I didn't really get into Doom. I, I try to play Doom after Rage 2, because it's you the know, same developer. Um I don't know. I didn't I didn't love the controls as much. So I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna give it another try though. I'm, I'm not done with Doom. I just got, I wanna give it another try. But yeah, you can see here Fallout 76. <laughs> Keep going. Uh yeah, yeah, just any games I've had over the years are, are here. A, a lot of Xbox free games too. And so you we see any that you really love. Can you tell me in the comments like as I'm going through, like, man, that one really stands out. For instance, you all play Killer Instinct. I wish I would have got into that. I like fighting games. I never got into that. Uh, I did finish both of these games. Uh, all the Lego games I finished that are here. Uh, it's Life of Strange. We talked about that. Marvel Ultimate Alliance. I, I know it's on the Switch now. I did play and finish that. Max Curse of the Brotherhood such a good... Uh, I don't know if it's considered an indie game, but it's really good. Uh, all the old M NBA games. Some of them I removed from... from yeah, okay, so there's some games that even from this, I look for, this is 2014, I can hide from list, right? So I did that for a lot of games. So there's even more games that I have, but I, I kind of hid some because I just wanted it off my list. Like, I don't know, NBA 2K, 
seven <laughs> like any just any old 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 games and so yeah there you there you go uh, oh there's rage 2 i really loved it i yeah i played it i finished it loved it um sorry i'm going a little fast here so yeah you could just see what what i either have finished or just have storage the nice thing about that neat like what section i'm in now that waiting to install or whatever it's called these are on xbox's servers so they're not going anywhere so i do this to save space on my hard drive i'm not actively playing or plan to play games i tend to just uninstall them and put them over here but if i know i might jump into it i keep them on the hard drive like the jackbox games i know i might only play those twice a year but i want them to be available if someone comes over to play so i have them available oh i can't wait for Watch Dogs 3 guys i can't it is my most even even more so than cyberpunk Watch Dogs 3 is my most anticipated game as of now I, that i I just I can't wait till March. <laughs> That's all. I just can't wait. So there you go. And okay, we can show some of the apps. So these are the apps I have uh, installed. Not much because I, I usually use my TV app or the Apple TV or whatever. Or I have a Chromecast built into each one. I'm not built in, but like a test each one of my TVs. So these are more so convenient. I do use a Twitch app every single night because there's a streamer that I watch every night. Shout out to Burke Black. Love Burke. Every night I'm in his stream. He's us. Uh, well, six nights a week he streams. And uh, I, I watch them every night. And then YouTube, of course. I use, Those are the two I use the most. Twitch and YouTube. Netflix, I'll usually use from the TV. Because I have an LG TV. And I just, I just use that interface. Because it's easier. And I don't have to turn on the Xbox. So, here's your homework. Uh, what, where's that queue here? Oh, it's still downloading. Sorry. Okay. I was like, what's going on? Your homework is, you saw all these games. Obviously, I can say all of them. Which ones stand out to you? Which ones do you like, Lamar? Wait a minute. You didn't play that? Will you play that or I'm gonna hurt you? Don't hurt me, but just tell me in the comments below uh, which ones I should be playing. And if I'm missing any apps you think I should I should have, let me know. Uh, one thing I didn't see on this Xbox that I do have, yeah, here, let me show you this. Um, oops, okay. because all my, I have three Xboxes in the house, so they all sync together, but I haven't installed all the apps here. However, go to my homepage and let's see so yeah these are the fc so some of these are, are not installed here but they're installed across my network so uh cbs all access i do have a subscription to that dc universe i use that almost always on xbox because because uh lg doesn't have an app for it so when i want to watch titans actually titan season two started i watch it on the xbox i have hbo go uh because that came with my phone and uh voodoo i just keep for, for movies and stuff and then yeah xbox movies movies and tv i keep and uh, these are just some games i pin in case i want to jump really really quick into them and so uh yeah there, there you go okay i showed you and i still got that capcom marvel vs capcom 2 in the back because i love spider-man so there you go guys uh let me know which games that uh, you play that you saw play do you love some as many as much as i love let me know i i, I did this video for you all because you all asked and uh I, I don't know if by now i have done a what's on my switch if i did already cool if i didn't let me know if you want that i, I know you all probably want a what's on my ps4 i've never done one of those so let me know in the comments below again shout out to seagate listen now everything that, that all my games or all on that drive it's really awesome just a beautiful drive uh check out the link below uh it's two terabytes so even if your xbox is one terabyte or 500 gigs get an external drive it, it'll it will save your life <laughs> i don't know if it actually save your life but it'll your gaming your gaming life will be appre will appreciate it so all right <laughs> I don't, i'm rambling i'll talk to y'all later thanks so much for watching i'll see you in the next video bye